You say, because you weren't originally from this country. No, I'm from you, Russia originally. You, you say this is one of the most tolerant countries you know. It is. It is. And even the introduction that you gave where you talked about the rise in recorded hate crime has actually been debunked by the Office of National Statistics, who say that uh, hate crimes have dropped by 40% in this country in the last 10 years. What we're seeing is we're taking the issue of hate more seriously, so the police are getting better and better at tracking and recording these crimes. Another aspect of it, actually, is that if you are rude to me on the course of this program and I perceive that this is motivated by my ethnicity or my religious background and I report this to the police, the police are required to record that as a hate incident without investigating at all. So we saw only a few weeks ago uh, somebody retweeting a supposedly transphobic limerick and that being recorded as a hate incident, not a crime but as a hate incident and that person getting a call from the police and being told that they need to check their thinking. Uh, so what we're seeing I think is, is a rightful focus on making sure there's no hate in, the, in society, but this is, uh, Britain has never been more tolerant and this is one of the most tolerant societies how, how, in the world. How, how do you see that tolerance? How does it show itself in the British character? Or not in some cases? I think if people ask themselves, are we now a more tolerant society than we were in the 70s and 80s? I think everyone will recognize that that's happened. Uh, and this, you know, as an immigrant here, I've been welcomed myself. You know, I, I'm, I'm not oblivious to the fact that some people are xenophobic and some people are racist. I've had people tell me to go back to Pakistan. Right. And I'm from Russia, right? And that's a reference to my skin color. So I'm not oblivious to that. But what I think has is, is happened is we, uh, there's a narrative in the media which is to talk about hate, to talk about all these issues and ignore the facts. Yeah. What do you think? Well, <clears throat> even the language that uh, he uses is problematic because